Now that we've set up our scaling, we're ready to create our parting line. To do this, we're going to go up to our Mold Tools tab and select Parting Line. And we have to pick a surface or plane. So we're just going to pick our top plane and we'll do a draft analysis with the draft set at 0.5 degrees. This allows us to see which portion of our part will go into the core and which one will go into the cavity portion of the mold. And it also creates a nice parting line around this top edge of our part. And it says here that our parting line is complete and the mold can be separated into its core and cavity, which is what we want to see. So we will hit OK and we now have a parting line. To create our parting surface, we're going to go up to our mold tools and select parting surface. And you see here it creates a ruled surface that generates outward from our parting line and it is perpendicular to the direction of pull. And if we adjust this value here, we see we can increase its size. So we'll set it to 1.50 inches. And we want to make sure that knit all surfaces is selected. And everything looks good. So we'll hit OK. And we have successfully created our parting surface. In our next video, we'll be able to do our tooling split to create our core and cavity for this mold.